April is National Financial Literacy Month, and it's dedicated to highlighting the importance of understanding how our money works. And with us today is Kurt Bach, the CEO of Country Financial, with advice on how to take charge of your money management habits. Hello, Kurt. How are you this morning? Hello, Denise. Thanks for having me on today. Very good to have you. So now, I found out that you, um, you recognize there's a difference between the way men and women seek financial advice. Tell us more. Well, well, uh, as a part of National, Fi National Financial Literacy Month, uh, Country Financial uh, released our Country Financial S uh, Security Index, which really uh, assesses attitudes toward personal finance. And this uh, month, uh, we found that men are more apt to seek financial advice over women. In fact, of the 11 areas we sampled, all the way from retirement planning, tax planning, to purchase a home or even insurance, uh, men are more apt to reach out for advice o over women. And that's why this month's an important month. It is important, to, I think, to make women more aware. So how is Country Financial participating in Financial Literacy Month? Well, we, we do it every day, and uh, it's part of the 5,000 people that make up the company. But for this month, we're partnering in Money Smart Week, which is coming up April 22nd through the 29th, which is a public partnership outreach to make the public aware of how you can take control of your personal finances. So now how can we determine personally what our priority should be and the opportunities that we could have? Yeah, it's, uh, well, it starts with uh, kind of attitudes. We found in our research that most Americans are uh, very uh, concerned about do they have enough money for short-term unexpected expenses, uh, for health care costs, and even for uh, vacations. And so uh, actually understanding your, your, your short-term uh, needs, and we do this uh, very simply by having a money audit, understanding where your money is coming from and where it's going to. And, and it could be as simple as understanding what you pay for cable, what you pay for a cup of coffee at the local coffee shop before you start uh, thinking about what kind of long-term goals you need. I do think that um, finances can be complicated for some people and they don't understand it and they don't they have a lot of questions. Do you think that Americans in general yeah. have a good understanding about um, their finances? Well, our survey says, uh, says no. In fact, most Americans don't feel they have the kind of information or education to understand their savings or their investments. And, and so uh, that's uh, one of the things I think we're, we're awfully passionate about. Uh, understanding and, and planning is really just not for the wealthy. It's absolutely for everyone. That's, uh, that's what we do. Absolutely, it would be for everyone. So why do you think that we lack that understanding? You know, uh, obviously, uh, it's, uh, it's very difficult sometimes in, in the short term. In fact, sometimes uh, you hear the language of finance and it's not understandable to, uh, to, 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 for everyone. So what we like to do is bring it down into common terms uh, to, to be able to understand what you really need short term, what you need long term, and then, uh, and then basically finding people that will help. More often, we're, we turn to our family. In fact, uh, most advice, uh, the most uh, trusted advisors for us oftentimes are our family, followed by others. And so we also want to make that trusted advice circle to be a little bit larger and include someone that uh, does it for, uh, uh, to help people understand their finances, so like a financial advisor. Yes, I think it's very important. At some point, you need to turn it over to the professionals who can really answer every question you have and, like you said, break it down. Yep, put it in common terms, yep. Common terms, very good. Any other financial advice for us before we let you go? Well, uh, I guess uh, uh, the most important thing I would always say, and we always would say, is start. Start somewhere. Uh, because uh, the, the biggest tragedy, tragedy is when people don't plan and end up at the end uh, ready to retire and don't understand what they need to continue to live that long and prosperous retirement life. So, so if anything, it's start now, start early. And that's why Money Smart and financial literacy are passions for a country financial. Very good advice. Thanks, Kurt. Thanks for making us part of your day. And for more information, you can visit their website at countryfinancial.com.